Good morning from Alamogordo, New Mexico on a beautiful day, another beautiful day to be here. The winds are going to be blowing 250 miles an hour today, <coughs> approximately. Oh, I don't know that. They say it's a high wind day. Sometimes they're right, sometimes they're wrong. I don't care. Actually, I kind of enjoy the wind. I'd rather have it a little, little breezy than just dead calm, but that's just me. Why? Because it just feels better. Anyway, uh, what else? Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Make it a good one. It's the day after yesterday, day before tomorrow. It's right now, and right now went right on by. You didn't even feel the pain. So anyway, dream it, wish it, do it, and uh, never worry about what you don't, you can't change. You know what I mean? But I can change my cargo van into a camping van, and I'm doing it. I'll show you later. You got some stuff coming up today on that, and then you also have an old driving video, I drove my Corolla uh, hybrid up the mountain to Cloudcroft, and I did a video, so you'll get to see that today for those of you that remember the car the car I had for a whole month, unbelievably. Scary, isn't it? But anyway, uh, what else? Uh, yeah, we're moving good on the uh, uh, van build, I guess you'd call it. And uh, yeah, we got some more stuff here. I'll do a video of that today, and then that'll come up in a few days, and on and on. But I want to give a shout out, a big old shout out to my sister Jean in Victoria, Texas, whose birthday is today. She is 83 years young, and uh, yeah, she's she's very very alert. She's techy. She knows all kinds of stuff. She does good. She walks every day good for her and yeah she's in good health <clears throat> i don't think she takes any medication at all as far as i know but anyway happy birthday Jean! enjoy your day many more moving along to hellcat granny oh dear i missed a few videos and the world of rusty has changed again keep on rusty hugs thank you hellcat granny check her channel out on youtube she races cars She's, I don't know, she's 70-something years old. She's got two or three Dodge Hellcats. Give her thumbs up for that. Uh, Ralph P., love the trains. Thanks, Rusty. Still the cheapest way to carry bulk loads. I guess you're right. Ralph P., again, getting your tiny no-build van build going. Nice. The potty looks great as long as you don't have much movement while you're doing a movement. LOL. Well, what it was, I was trying to do it with one hand. You're supposed to you know, pull it apart and then twist it, and it locks into place. But I was trying to do it with one hand, and it looked like it was difficult and slow, but it's not. It's it's a great little toilet, and I'm glad I got it. D. Anderson, that collapsed poop bucket is really pretty nifty. Yeah, uh, it is. It is. <clears throat> Dennis, good morning, Rusty. Just getting caught up on yesterday's three videos. Hope the van works out well. For you, enjoy the day. Yeah, so far, so good. I went out yesterday to Oliver Lee and spent some time. You'll see that video coming up. Keep your health, Dennis. Check his channel out on YouTube. Boondocking with Dennis. Monica's, Monica, sweetheart. Boredom can definitely be a drug that's hard to kick. Keep on keeping on. Well, I am definitely doing that, and I intend to do it as long as I can. Uh, this is uh, he said. This is JR seventy fifty five. Says congratulations on a great car. That's the Corolla. Bye. <laughs> Don't have it anymore. <laughs> that was a whole month ago. You so grouchy. Capitan doesn't get the forest fires, but grass fires have happened all around the village. You know, did you finally find something negative about Capitan? Well, I'm so happy for you. I mean, you know, they don't get this, they don't get that, but they do have, you know, geez, it's a great place to live. But anyway, that's why he got the name You So Grouchy. Anyway, <clears throat> No Way Jose, Giddy Up, Van Go. Yeah, we're we're working on it. We, we got, uh, again, I got some stuff right there ready to go. I've got the little refrigerator in and it's, oh, you're going to love it. You're going to love it. it. It's even pretty to look at. But anyway, King for a day in elementary school, train tracks ran right behind our house. We would place pennies on the tracks when we heard a train approaching. One time a kid placed a dang quarter. OMG, we thought he was rich. The problem came in riding finding a coin after the train ran over. Yeah, it did. That, that's true. But we did that too. Sashi Smith, hi, Rusty. Great prep for Van Gogh. Yeah, we're, we're getting there, baby. We're getting there. Uh, 
Yeah, King for Dace's cabooses were originally was used as an office and a place for the crew to sleep. Yeah, that's true, and, and uh, they don't use them anymore. They got an electronic device back there that takes the place of the caboose. Uh, user says, cool shed, but my favorite antique furniture wouldn't fit in there because of the space. Well, whatever, then I think, let me, let me do the thinking for you here, user. Don't buy it. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> Debbie Webby, uh, no military vehicles. I didn't see any on the, on the train. Same person, you and Sarasota Tim would probably hit it off. I, whatever, why don't you, and why don't you go get old Sarasota Tim, Debbie? I mean, that'd be a better match. Uh, Scotty Thompson, cool video, cool video. Uh, Bowling League tonight, uh, okay, he's hoping to get three 200 games. His dad's hoping to get 300, 200 games. Well, go get them, Scotty. Don't cut him any slack. Take no prisoners. Levi says, Rusty, you can camp at my place anytime you want with Van Gogh. Thank you, uh, Levi, <clears throat> for the offer, but I will see. We'll see. I won't say no, but I'm not going to say yes. I will see. <clears throat> yeah, you got a nice place. And anyway, moving along to Blender, no, Blend, Blind Retro Gamer. Sorry, Blind Retro Gamer. Wonder if Hobo Shoestring hopped a ride on that train. I don't know who that is, but I, he may have. Uh, I agree with me. I do too. I know the feeling. When I was a kid, we used to put 16, na number 16 nails on the train track and make little swords. Yeah, that'd be smart. We didn't have any nails. Well, we had nails. I don't remember. We, did. we didn't do that. That's cute. Very good. Tyler says, make sure that the power strip is actually surge protector. A lot of those do nothing to protect your electronics from surges. Well, I guess it is. I've had it for years and never had any problems. James Ortiz, Mesa Verde Ranch, runs a big construction company. They put in a large subdivisions in Alamogordo and Holloman Air Force Base. Well, they must be uh, it must be pretty big, but maybe that's what they're doing. They're building uh, subdivisions on their ranch. <clears throat> they could be doing that, you know what I mean? And uh, along the way we go. Anyway, uh, what else? <clears throat> MD Grimes, okay, my head is spinning. You're doing an awful lot, you Rusty. Yeah, that's me. I just do me, man. Hang on, you know, hang on to my coattails, and I'll drag you through the world. Stephen Greco. My favorite YouTube channel is Rusty78609. You've got good taste, Stephen. Uh, Lisa Chipper. I love Van Gogh. Remember, you could use magnets with all that metal. I got 12 uh, magnets hooks, and they're really powerful. You know, you could, they'll hold about 25 pounds, you know. And so, yeah, they're going to come in handy for a lot of stuff. Uh, Kenneth Kilpatrick had an 87 Toyota cargo van. Cargo floor was seven feet long. Bought a queen-size bed queen size foam mattress topper and cut to fit the floor. Took the trimmed off part and filled in gap on the front part of the floor by the seats. The topper couldn't quite cover, then put a blanket over all that, tucked around the sides and ends, cut way down, blah, 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 cut way down on road noise, insulated the van better and made it easy on my knees in the back. Also bought a well, whatever, yeah, but uh, this thing came with a padded rubber mat floor, and, and the good thing about the, the rubber flooring in the rear is things don't slip around. You know, they, they don't move. They just sit there. I thought I was going to have to use Velcro tape or something to keep stuff from moving around, but that's not the case. You know, it just sits there. James Jackson, that was a long train. That was the name of the video, a long train. Uh, doing it with nothing. Wednesday afternoon in Oklahoma uh, at a Corps of Engineers site, 78 Snake Creek, coal, six days, then move on. You're going to be at uh, Corps of Engineers for six days. Enjoy it, doing it with nothing. Uh, Don Bram, nice ride. Yeah, Corps of Engineers parks are, are usually very nice. Anyway, Don, thank you. Uh, same person, cool. Steve, uh, what is this? Shepatown. The Amazon link doesn't seem to go anywhere to anything special. No, it usually doesn't. I, it just takes you to Amazon and then you can buy what you want. I used to do that. I used to take it to, uh, you know, uh, you know, products that I had gotten or whatever, but it's better just to take you to, to the Amazon site and you buy whatever you want. Uh, anyway, Shep, Shepatown or whatever, same person. 
This is just going to be a quickie. Reminds me of the office when when they made those. That's what she said jokes. Okay, never mind. Yeah, okay. Two seventy seven K and E. I got I got get the idea of the collapsible potty. My preference is a bucket with a screw on lid. I've seen seven gallon buckets on a restaurant supply website. You can do anything you want to. You know, just so you just so you hit the pot. <clears throat> Doing it with nothing, you got got it going now. Well, I got it going right, babe. Rocky Mountain Robert, those mountains are either the San Andreas Mountains or the Oregon Mountains to the south. Uh, let me think, what direction was I looking there? I think I was actually looking north from that from that view, okay? I think I was facing north. So anyway, enough said. Uh, Mr. Safety, that's a mansion compared to your Prius. You once own, take care. Yeah, no, it is. It is. It's a. It is a mansion compared to the Prius, and the Prius was doable. But this is doable. This is a Van Gogh. Uh, Doss is Van Gogh. Gotta love it. You the man. You the man. I'm the man. Mister Pumpkin, no nothing. Enjoy your stay. I will. Caravan Dan Adventures. Uh, the adventure continues. Rusty got it in his blood. My hat don't hang on the same nail too long. My ears can't stand to hear the same old song and I don't leave the highway long enough to bog down in the mud because I've got rambling fever in my blood. Did you make that up? <laughs> anyway, DH2 Prophet, I always liked it when there was someone on the caboose and he would wave at you as the train went by. Yeah, they used to do that. They, they, they used to wave. We'd get them to wave. We thought that was so neat. User said, you will be sitting on that plastic pooper and it will collapse. See, there's somebody thinking positive. Way to go. Another user thinking positive. Uh, anyway, thank you. Uh, Ambrosia Marvin, the train, but no caboose. That's correct. Not needed anymore. They use a TED, train-in device. That's what Louis Paparella says. Anyway, SD, you are right on, Rusty. Don't watch the news. I agree with you. Anyway, we'll get uh, about three or four more here. I'm going to be taking a long drive today in the, on a windy day in New Mexico. And I got some things I want to check out and uh, see what's going on around me here. I'm E88. I love train. Do you know that Amtrak have an offers trip from Florida to California, complete with sleeping cube and all meals, all you can bring, and you also you can bring your vehicle with you. Another option, Rusty. Yeah, that's cool. You could Amtrak take your car with you. Cool. Poodle Professor, great start. Yeah, we're on a roll, Jennifer. Check her channel out on YouTube. Poodle Professor, thank you. Jason Bobber, Baber, great video on the train. Yeah, it was super, wasn't it? I mean, that was just amazing uh michael thomas excellent on the stuff for the van go <laughs> here we got uh three more lined up jim borer i once saw an amarella i once saw one in amarella that had three engines front and back i arrived at the gate I arrived as the gate cut came down but was first to get across the track well good for you jim dancing past midnight catchy name I was under the impression that the road led to the back entrance of Halliman Air Force Base. I guess I was wrong. Could you do a video of a drive-through of that subdivision located behind the theater? I'm curious how big it is. No, I'm not going to do that video. I probably won't. Thank you, though. Beauregard Rippy, last one, I guess, or almost. Uh, stop by the Chamber of Commerce on White Sands Boulevard sometime and pick up some literature on all the area events. I might do that. Sue Palmer, enjoy your life and your dreams. I will live your dreams. Rita Richardson, hope you bought your brought your lunch while you were waiting for the trains. I love old trains. So beautiful. Me too. But anyway, guys, again, happy birthday, Jean. <laughs> she had a little boyfriend when she was in elementary school. He was retarded. His name was Jimmy. And, and Jimmy used to holler at her through the school fence. Jean, Jean. <laughs> Anyway, happy birthday. Anyway, thumbs up, Carpe Diem, adios, bye, 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 anything you want. Use the Amazon link in the description of all of my videos. Why? Because it doesn't cost you a penny. Just click on the link, go to Amazon and get what you want if you're going to buy something from Amazon. Anyway, what else? Drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day won't hurt you. 
Take deep breaths, breathe in, breathe out slowly. Why? That relieves stress. And relieving stress does what? Lowers your blood pressure. Is that good for you? Yes, do it several times a day. Why am I doing my hands like this? Because I just do. And then what else? <clears throat> Stretch, swivel, walk, all that stuff. Exercise your body once or twice every single day. And then stand guard at the door of your mind. Accentuate the positive. Eliminate the negative. Enjoy your life one day or one moment at a time. At ease, carry on. Adios, bye-bye. Hasta luego, vaya con Dios. Aloha until next video. You got two videos coming up today. You got one on uh, the RV stuff uh, and then a uh, second one or RVing and then one on uh, uh, the Corolla going up the mountain to Cloudcroft. Adios, amigos. Enjoy your life. Bye-bye.